Trinity is held in the Anomalium, which is in this transmission tower. The passages used to rescue Neo are now sealed, and a legion of sentinels patrols the tower. So stealth will be paramount. As long as we raise no alarm, this first part of the mission should be the easiest. You mean crossing the fetus fields, sneaking across an entire power plant, climbing a two-kilometer tower guarded by thousands of sentinels? That's the easy part? Exactly so. Because all we have to do is convince someone who does this every day to take one of us along. Fifty meters below the anomalium is a stratum of amniotic filters. Hidden along this edge is a small hexagonal vent. This vent feeds the air intake into the corpuscular modifier, which oxygenates the biogel used in Neo's pod. I get it. The exomorph slinkies up Neo's old umbilicus. What could go wrong? Once inside, Morpheus will use the system operator to open the evacuator line and disengage the macerators. In order to unplug Trinity's body while her mind still remains connected to the Matrix, I'm gonna need a second human brain to implement the bypass. And since Neo must be with the analyst, the only available mind that's a near enough match is yours. Figures. Does Trinity still have to take the red pill? Since Kujaku and I are transferring her consciousness onto the ship, it's not strictly necessary. But what matters is that this is her choice. Extracting a confused or an uncertain mind will, in all probability, kill her. But even if it is what she wants, won't the analyst just order the Sentinels to stop you? He will. But if my plan works, it won't matter. Why? Because we'll already be gone. Somebody thinks this hard about a plan, there has to be a reason why. When my father realized how the Anomalium was going to be used, he covertly transferred the designs to me. The analyst discovered his betrayal and had my parents perched. I would have been murdered too if it wasn't for Kujaku. Not a day goes by that I don't grieve them. I've been praying for this day for a very long time.